Elsewhere, Ogun State Deputy Governor Noimot Salako Yedele has appealed to applicants of Project TMAX in the state to make good use of the opportunity provided for them by the federal government. Mr. Salako Yedele made the appeal during the flag off of the screening exercise at the government technical college, Idiaba. She commended the federal government for considering Ogun State as one of the seven pilot states for the project. On his part, the senior special advisor to President Muhammad Buhari on education interventions, Fela Bankolimo, said 42,000 youth applied for the training in Ogun State and they can only consider 2,000. He added that 18 centers have been certified in the state for the smooth takeoff of the free training. On young people in Ogun State who could potentially have also registered for this program. I want to assure you that I, on my own, and of course the government of Ogun State, will work closely with Project TMAX to make sure that the maximum benefit is what is accruable to all our citizens who have, are registered and are successful during the screening period and go through the training. We know that at the end of the training, there will be some support to you so that you can go ahead and start new businesses. We have accredited 18 centers in Ogun State. 16 of them are private sector owned, two are government centers. And um, after we finish the screening over the next um, Tuesday, Wednesday, next week, when we finish the screening, then the training will start a week after. You know, but the exciting thing is to see the number of people are excited, they want to be part of the program. Um, at the data we have from Ogun State, the number one skill that most people wanted to learn for was solar solar installation, the second was uh, fashion design and tailoring, the third was beauty and the other was graphics design and all that. So uh, we're excited to see that people want to be part of the program. Nigerians want skills to improve themselves and TMAX is doing that for them.